it's Christine. Thank you guys for clicking on my video. And if you did find my video on YouTube, it only means one thing. It's either we're looking at the same bag or we just have the same interest. And if you do find my video interesting, entertaining, or even informative, please do like and subscribe so I can make more videos that is bag related or maybe just life in general related. Because in this channel, we men supporting women. All right, so I wanted to share with you guys what I got from Coach Boutique. This is actually my very first um, purchase from the boutique. I don't normally go into the boutique because we don't have them nearby. Um, we actually drove to South Coast Plaza for this one. And it's not like I specifically went there for this. It just so happened that they have this bag there. And I, when I found it, I was like, yes, I like that. And then... Yeah, I can go on and on with the story in a sec, but before I do, um, can you please kindly subscribe and like this video? Okay, so in South Coast Plaza, it's a big mall, two big malls connected with one bridge. So if you have enough energy, you will walk around that mall. We didn't have that much energy. We went like in the afternoon, and so we only went to a few stores. I mean, you name every store you could think of, they've got all the designers and luxury brands. But we only went to the specific stores that I wanted to go to. And initially, we walked into the coach because I wanted to ask for a dust bag. I know, silly me. I went in there asking for a dust bag and then the guy explained to me that not all bags by coach come with dust bags, just some of them. Um, or no, he said most of them come with dust bags, some of them don't. And I told him that I got a pillow tabby. And he's like, oh yeah, that one has to have a dust bag. But the pillow tabby that I got, I actually got it from Saks Fifth Avenue. And so I didn't know how to reach them because I bought it online. And anyhow, they were kind enough to give me a dust bag for my pillow tabby anyway. So I was waiting for the dust bag. I was at the register. And then at the bottom of the register, there was a hidden gem. And it was this one. All right, if you guys haven't seen my video, I don't know why you haven't. Maybe you should click off real quick and then watch the other video that I posted about Coach um, Cassie. I believe it was Cassie. Oh no, Coach Chase. Um, basically, I bought this bag from Nordstrom.com. If you don't know, I only buy bags that are on sale or if I can buy them, I will buy. If they're not on sale, I might consider buying them if they're at Nordstrom because of the points. So. I bought this um, Chase in Dark Pebble. I initially bought this one and another style, which is the Kip, which I have in this box. I'm gonna show you in just a sec. So sorry that I'm t taking so long to get there. But to give you a background story, this was my second option. My first option was the Kip in Dark Pebble. But then Nordstrom wasn't able to fulfill it because they went out of stock immediately. So my order wasn't able to be fulfilled. So. I got this one instead, um, or not that I got this one instead, I bought both of them actually, but only this one made it through the order. So this is the dark pebble, right? Now, when I was at coach, no, this is not dark pebble. I got something else. And I just wanted to share that, you know, God would really do something for you. And basically I wanted, what I thought I wanted, but God said, no, I have some something better for you because this bag is in a different color. So it's really big and the, <laughs> and then the box is big, but the bag is really small, but they asked me if I wanted it all wrapped up. So I said, sure, why not? I didn't think it was gonna be wrapped up this big. But anyways, um, so this is the coach kip and if you know the color canyon, then that's the color of this bag. Now, I was able to get this bag at a low price. It wasn't discounted, but when I when I was looking through my email, I had a discount for Coach Insider. And so I had a $50 off and I had 20, 25% off. So I got it for um, a discounted price. 
and then the color is so beautiful. So I was meant to not get the dark pebble because I had God prepared something better for me, which is this one. Now you won't find this in the online website or you won't find this at any other um, store competitors like Saks Fifth Avenue, Nordstrom, um, Macy's, it's not there. I don't know when this came out, but when I, when I looked them up in YouTube, I've seen posts about this color about a year ago. Now, I'm just so blessed to find this at the store and I'm so, so, so happy because I love the color. And although the size is not the best size, it's pretty small. Um, if you have a phone bigger than an iPhone 12 Pro Max, it will not fit here because I have an iPhone 12 Pro Max and it doesn't fit this bag. You can only fit so much in here, but it's enough. It's big enough to fit your essentials. Well, at least when you're on to go. So um, I did try this on already. It falls right up my hip um, and it's a beautiful color. Um, it's color Canyon and this looks more orange, but I would say that this is a bit more of a brown, but not too brown because this is orange. This is burnt orange. So I'm going to put them side by side so you can see. So when you kind of change the angle on the lighting, it kind of, I don't know if you could see it, but this is a definite, pretty, definitely pretty um, burnt orange. Um, that looks more on like the brown or side, I guess, kind of like cognate brown. Now a brown, or I would say true brown would be like the Michael Kors Jet, um, bag. So you can see the difference, even the size difference side by side. If you have the Michael Kors Jet bag. Yeah. So it's a very tiny bag. And so I'm not really much of a fan of Coach and I don't like their monogram pattern. Although I do have one um, signature bag that I got from the outlet from 2020, but that was the only Coach bag that I've had for a very long time. This recent purchases are the only time I've ever gotten Coach. And if you'll notice, these designs that I have don't even show that it's coach and my friend even told me that if i never told her it was coach she would have never known because it doesn't say anywhere in this bag that it's coach besides the charm now what i find attractive with this bags are the turn locks not the seam but the oval turn lock um i really love that design the aesthetics of it it's so so pretty then the leather the top handle it looks like a little messenger bag now it is a crossbody bag. It does come with a strap, which is this. And it's got um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven holes for adjustment. Um, mine is right at the middle. I've already adjusted this at the store and this one falls right at my hip. And the interior of the bag is just basically a textured canvas. It's just an open interior. Um, with side slip pocket and then you've got two card holders there on the side so if you choose not to use a card holder you can just use that to put in your card or cash and then on the back you have a back slip pocket which you can slide um, what receipts card or whichever you need easy access to now this one does come with a coach um, signature tag although I wish that it was just um, printed on one side so you can customize the back but it's printed coach on both sides so I don't think I can put in my initials anywhere there for customization but besides that it is still a pretty bag and then at the bottom of the bag it actually says genuine glove tan leather so it tells you what it is made of so I guess that explains why um, it's not a flat out orange or it's not flat out um, brown, you would actually see different um, shades of color here. So like it darkens here and then, yeah, I don't know if that makes sense. I don't know if my explanation makes sense. I don't know, but yeah. So 
I'm gonna give you guys a much closer look in just a minute. Um, I'm losing my train of thoughts here. So this bag actually reminds me of like the mini pochette Matisse by Louis Vuitton, except this one doesn't yell out any branding, which I really, really love. This is so, so stinking cute. And I'm actually gonna show you what fits in this bag. So here's the up close of the bag. The stitching on this one is really clean. Again, that is the tab that has coach um, stamped on each side. So as I turn, you'll notice that the color of the bag changes depending on the lighting. It is such a beautiful bag. Um, and in the top handle, the stitching is really pretty. But yeah, so let's get to what fits in my bag. So normally I would use a card holder. So I'm going to put it with the card holder. So this is my card holder, my Tory Burch Kira, my key fob pouch. So I now have my key fob pouch or coin purse, however you want to call it, because I have my key fob in there. I would use my lotion and I'm going to slide in a feminine care in the back slip pocket because you never know when you'll need it. And then I'm going to put in my AirPods in there. So that's what I have so far. I mean, when I'm on the go, that's really all I need. Just my card holder, lotion, Air AirPods, and my key, if I, or card holder. Oh my good, I, I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. And then of course my house keys. So I'm just gonna put it in there. Ta-da! And I even have, um, so it closes, right? And it looks like I even have room for sunglasses. So I'm gonna toss a pen in there. I don't normally put in my pen in a bag like this. I usually have a pencil case. So I'm gonna put in my daily sunglasses. This is by Tory Burch. Sorry, one second here. I'll make sure that my keys are not scratching my glasses. So yeah. Ta-da! So right there, it, it just slides in. Hold on one second. Mm, I know it fits with a little bit of a struggle to close. It fits. Um, does it keep its shape? We'll see. It sure does. And you can still put some stuff in there. Hardly any though, because now that the bag is so filled up, but look how pretty that is. I know it looks so small, but I love this bag. It's so nice and cute. Now, if you prefer to put your phone in the bag and if it can fit, then you may be able to get away by not using a card holder because there is already a slot for cards there and some cash. And then you'll have room for your phone. So that's that. Now, Size comparison, um, the Cassie is about the same size as far as width, but the height, this is definitely much taller. Um, and then with the Jet bag by Michael Kors, obviously this is a much bigger bag. But other than that, that's it, that's the bag. So that's pretty much what I have to share about the bag. I am really happy about this purchase. It's so worth it. I am just so genuinely excited to share about this purchase because of how beautiful this color is. I do wish that Coach will come out with this color again or even Mustard, but not for me to purchase, but like, you know, for you guys, because I think that everybody should have this bag for an on-the-go or just for, you know, if you have a big tote bag, because sometimes I go out on like a long day trip with my family, I would have a big tote bag and I would want to have like a small bag that I can carry with me 
which this would be a perfect one. So this is a good purchase. But yeah, so that's all I have for you. What do you guys think about the kit, the coach kit bag? Do you think the color is pretty or meh? Do you think the size is too small or functional? Or what do you think? Is it a waste of money? But yeah, we don't have anything else to say. That's all I have. Well, thank you guys for watching. Bye for now.